Hello Zebraherd and welcome to Unravel 2. You might know that we played the original Unravel two years ago. That's that's a lot of twos. It featured our favorite little buddy Yarny and it was just an amazing side going adventure. I played through it all right here and it was so much fun. And now we're gonna be playing the second one. Apparently it has some co-op stuff with it but I'm gonna be just playing it single player because that looked fun to me. It was cool because yesterday it was announced and then they were just like, hey, it's out right now. So usually games are announced, they take a little while to come out. Not this time, boom, the game is out. I don't know how much time I'll have to play with this right now just because there's tons of games I'm playing already. So it might be a little slow with the episodes, but I'll try to make them nice and long, try to get like a level done per episode, which if I remember the first game, they're like an hour each. With that being said, I'm rambling too much. Let's go ahead and get started with Unravel 2. Chapter one, Foreign Shore, in which we lose everything, but start anew. Oh. This is a boat. Uh, there's nobody in the boat. <laughs> That's not good. Oh no, Yarny's on it. Hold on, buddy. <laughs> this is not good at all. Don't tell me he just went to sea all by himself. The poor thing. Oh gosh, I hope he knows how to swim. I mean, yarn doesn't really float all too well when it gets all wet. Hold on tight, buddy. No, <laughs> this is bad. The, the journey's ending before it starts. Oh gosh, he lost his connection. Now I know what the quote meant. First, before you, you start anew, you have to lose everything. Oh, there's a little lighthouse. Maybe they're looking for Yarny. Somebody figured out he was out there. Oh boy. So he made it out okay, but he's actually looking a little thin. A little low on yarn. Wow, okay, what are we gonna do about that? Oh, that's all you got. Barely able to keep yourself together. He also has an extra little spike on the top of his head. He usually only has two. Huh? Oh, long let lost brother? Blue Yarny? Yarno? <laughs> Yarny and Yarno, are they, those are names? I don't know, I'm making this up. Hi. Oh, now we have a friend, right? Are we gonna connect? Oh, that's so cute. So we got a red one and a blue one now. That is so cool. So I did see a little bit of the demo and it looks like you get to play between the both of them or you can sort of combine them into one. I wanna see how that works a little bit more. So can I move? Not yet. Oh, now I can. So yeah, how do I play as both of them? To switch between characters by pressing triangle. So I'm playing as blue. I'm gonna call him Yarno and then I'm gonna call <laughs> red one Yarny. Uh, stand close to a character and hold triangle to carry them. Okay, hop on my back. All he really does is hug him and then he all wraps up in him. That's so adorable. Oh my gosh, I love it. Some objects can be pushed like this one. So this already seems like it plays a lot like the original game, which is great. Press triangle to drop the character you were carrying. Okay. I don't remember everything about it. It's been two years. Uh, when you switch away from a character, they will carry on holding objects. When you switch away, okay, so like if I have you push this and then I switch to you, you're gonna keep pushing, which is actually really good. Oh boy, oh boy. Uh, stand close to the other character and then hold triangle to carry them. So I wanna switch to you and start carrying you, I guess. When it's in a situation where only one character can get by, but yeah, I could see how you could sort of play co-op by yourself. Sitting close to another character. Yeah, I know, I'm already carrying them. So which one am I playing? I guess I'm playing as the blue one now with red Yarny sort of around him. This is so pretty as well. The first game blew me away with how nice it looked. Oh, there's more yarn in this one. You can change the, the way your character looks in the menu. Appearance. Oh, hey, look at this. So you have customization options. I wonder if we'll unlock more along the way because we have like Yarny's head style and Yarno's. And we can change the eyes. Uh, okay, one of them slightly larger. Then we can change the body. Oh, I see that. Okay, and then the color, that's really the big thing. Uh, I think I'll keep things how they are. I mean, I don't know if you can turn things into like white. And that way we can have a, a black and white one, you know, zebra-tastic. I mean, I guess, but I think it would be easier for me to tell what's going on and see the characters when they're red and blue. So we're gonna, we're gonna stick with that and that should be fine. And new threads, hey, look at that. Very cool, I, so there we go. We can customize our characters as well. But I would love to hear out of everybody who's watching, let me know if you've played the first game or if you've watched it, you know anything about it. Cause you know, the Zebra Herd wasn't as big when I played the original Unravel. 
Uh, hold X to jump higher and further, you got it. But so far it controls very similarly, so I'm enjoying it a lot because I just, I loved everything about the first game. You can change direction in the air. Well, I would hope so. But yeah, it platforms just as well, actually. Uh, press left to say hi, try left, right, and up for more actions. Oh, that's so cute, look, look, look. Hello! <laughs> what is this one? Oh, yay! And then down, oh. Oh, <laughs> he giggles. What about right? Oh, he's sitting down, he's taking a little nap. Oh, I love it, it really is a lot like Little Big Planet. Oh gosh, let's go this way. And we'll combine up again. Yeah, <laughs> I love it so much. Okay, well, we're, we're following this little glimmer, this little wisp, whatever it might be. Now I'm supposed to go over that way, but I wonder if there's any secrets. The original game was chock full of secrets, or at least you know, a good couple. You could find a secret in every level, which I never bothered doing. I, I sort of found this game to be enjoyable to play, but not to fully complete. Oh, I'm supposed to plop down like that. But you would think these tiny little specific spots, oh, we can wall jump? I don't think that was in the original game. I really don't remember it being, so I think that's new. But yeah, these little spots, you would think they'd be hard to land on, especially with our character so zoomed out, but it actually is pretty consistent with how it works. It's not that bad. So I like that. And then, pop down here. If you jump onto a wall, you can slide and then jump down, or jump off at any time. Huh. So did I just mess something up? Was I supposed to, oh, oh, what is this about? Uh, I can't go that way. Do I have to just go this way to reset myself? I think so. Uh, there we go. Yeah, I'm going back up this way because I guess I messed it up. Hopping off this tree. Uh, but what is all this over here? Nothing. Huh, okay. Just sort of a little detour to get back to where we were. Okay, I like it. Hiya, there we go. I didn't really time it well before. But as you can see, this game is just, it's surreal in so many ways. And I'm guessing, you know, if there is one chapter, we'll try to do a chapter an episode. Ooh, what's to the left, anything? I'll try to look for secrets, but I'm not gonna like be totally bent on, oh gosh, there's a little creepy crab, but uh, trying to get every customizable. So we can use our yarn to climb, and that's sort of a big mechanic. It's almost sort of like Spider-Man or something. It's pretty cool. So we can grab onto things like up that and climb up it. So we can do lassos, we can swing from things, we can use it to sort of pull other objects at times. Whoa, ho, ho. you can swing from the yarn, yes you can. Let's try that again. Oh my gosh. It was a little bit more than I was thinking. But I'm guessing with two characters, we could really make some things work when it comes to all of the uh, different mechanics with that. Like maybe one character can pull the other. One person can act as the pinpoint for the swing. You can only imagine that's gonna start happening, right? That made the most sense. Whoa. No, 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 I missed it. Oh, come on. Try that again. Still getting a little bit used to it, I guess. Swinging. Got it. I did feel like the first game was a bit on the difficult side at times. I'm wondering if this will tweak anything, you know, with it being multiple players, or maybe it'll just get really, really difficult. Oh boy. Okay, so that wasn't enough speed. Maybe, you know what? I don't need to do that, I can just lasso up. Yeah, there we go. We just had the wall jump to actually reach in. Oh boy, oh boy, whoa, ho, 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 be careful. So I think the first game took place in, I think, Sweden like the environments and stuff. I don't know where this game takes place. Obviously, Yarny's somewhere new on some kind of island. I wonder why he was leaving now. Uh, if you find a section difficult, you can get help. Help features can be on or off, or turned on and off in the gameplay menu. I don't mind them being on. You can use a little help from time to time. Oh boy. It is a little weird how close you have to be to the thing to actually hook on to it. Oh gosh, oh gosh, creepy crab. Leave me alone. I feel like that wasn't as much of a requirement in the previous game, but maybe it was. Well, I'll do what I can. Try to time things as well as possible. There we go, that wasn't too bad. Okay, so we're following this little thing still. See, I don't really know what our motives are at the moment, except for just try to find some uh, some kind of home. You can use the lasso to pull objects with knots. Like this. I wonder if there's anything under there. Guess not, I can't go in there, so probably not. I get a wall jump up like that. Oh, that, that is so nice, the controls are really good. Some things are a little bit to get used to, but I feel like it's, it's super solid controls. Whoa, we're sliding, okay, cool. You can use the, or you can switch while using the lasso, hold R2 
when you switch back if you want to keep hanging. What do you mean by that? So I can hold on like this, and then I can switch to a character like you. There we go, and we can get up here. This is exactly what I mean. Uh, then we can switch over to Yarny, and oh, you know what? I need you to stand over this way so that you can get up. Okay, that makes a ton of sense. So there will be times where we can't be combined to make things work, you know? We'll have to actually use the power of two that we got here. And that's why it's spelled out Unravel 2. It's not just a number, but it's spelled Unravel T-W-O. So maybe it's just that's a big focus on it, which I think is pretty cool. I don't know what that one text bubble said. I missed it. Hold down and jump to go through thin objects. Okay, we got it. Whoa, 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 we're sliding. So I can go down this way? I can indeed, okay. The water looks really nice. Everything about this game looks really nice. You can climb on surfaces with a yellow pattern. That's new. It's like Super Mario World or something. I like it. <laughs> okay, good stuff. Go on down this way. Gotta be careful. Looks like they want me to go that way, but I wanna see if there's anything down here. L so far, no kind of collectible found, which isn't always a bad thing. It just gets me concerned that I've missed something. Okay, so we can go back up there if we need to. I don't see why we would. Oh, I see, so we can plop off of there at the right spot. I need to go like this, and then whoop. Nice, okay, we're making it work. So tons of new mechanics. Press square at an attach point to tie a knot. Bridges can be tied between attach points. So this is, once again, something that happened in the first game. So we can make a little bridge, and we can Jump twice, just like that. I don't know why we broke into two here. Can we combine ourselves again? Uh, Tap circle anywhere to undo the last knot. Okay, there we go. So when we make knots and stuff, we can't be combined either. Uh, press L1 for hints. Press right to scroll through the hints. There are three hints for each section. Each hint will have more information than the last. Oh, that's so great. You can scroll back through the hints or tap L1 to close the browser. You can turn assist on or off in the gameplay menu. I really appreciate that because in the first game, there were a lot of spots where I would just get totally stuck. So I'm actually really, really appreciating that. It doesn't look like there's any way I can get up there. But if I get stuck, I have some hints now I can work with. So that's really good. Uh, you can push objects over bridges. Oh, yeah, 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 okay, so if we go ahead and set up this, just like that, and then I should be able to grab onto this and set up a knot, just like that, and then we can push this. Or I might have to switch over to Yarno. Yep, here we go, buddy, excuse me. So it seems like because of the fact that we have two characters, uh, both Yarny and Yarno probably only have about half as much of yarn as they normally would, which is you know a big explanation on why you lost so much yarn is for that gameplay mechanic. Okay, using this though, we can get up this way and keep following this little glowy light. Whoa, I almost got you that time. And there really isn't any other way to go, but still uh, worth trying to figure out. So I think what we gotta do is do that, go over this way, build this one, and then do the same thing. Maybe with the other character would have been better, but I think you get the idea. And then you can bounce up like that. And then we gotta get Yarno and sort of do the same thing. I might need him to do that, and then boing, boing. Okay, come on, come on. Got it. So it seems that there's probably gonna be multiple solutions with everything. Yay, okay, we combined. We're all clapping. Okay, this is interesting for sure. Whoa, are you okay, buddy? You just fell all the way down. I mean, I guess both of you did. Oh, this is not good. No, 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 don't get separated. No, the yarn between the characters runs out if they're too far apart. Holding L2 lets you climb it. Oh, look at this. Okay, so this is where that comes into play. Like I was saying before, whoa! <laughs> you guys okay? And I guess you guys being made of yarn really helps in that situation. Okay, can you guys combine? Yep, there you go. Let's move to the right. Hello, little glowiness. Oh, can we go down this way though? I suppose we can. I don't know if there's any benefit to it, but now I'm curious. Oh, we can't go down this. Okay, so I'm guessing there might be a point where we can fail, slide down, and try again. I'll keep that in mind. Okay, uh, hold the yarn with L2 and swing under the other character. So, I need to do that. Wow, okay. I mean, if we could just sort of separate ourselves a little bit more, then we can do this, switch over, right? And then, 
There we go, you work as an anchor point for me to hold myself up. Oh, well, isn't that great? No, gosh! <laughs> I got all confused. Uh, the power of two, really, it's just teamwork. Uh, you can, oh, oh, what's this? Oh, it's not fun. Uh, you can choose whether one or both players need to hold L2 to grab the yarn. Hmm. Well, it's only me, the one player, so that doesn't help me too much. Whoop, whoa, okay, I really like the sense of momentum now. It's really nice. So it doesn't seem like there's too much down here for us. Ooh, ow. <laughs> Not really what I was looking for. Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. No, 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 no. Uh, you can swing the yarn when it's looped over an object. Okay, I, I was sliding off though, this is a problem. Okay, well that still might be good, because then I can switch over to you, and oh, that might not work though. Okay, in hindsight, that was a bad idea. What do we do? This isn't right. Uh, Here, climb up a little bit, and then maybe you could from here start swinging. I might need you to, ow, yeah, that's not right. Come on, keep climbing, keep climbing. You got it. There we go. Okay, so now I can switch back to you, climb back up, Got it, okay, that makes a whole lot more sense. It's a little weird at times. Okay, let's have you guys combine again. Then what do we got this way? More of the same? Looks like it, so I do need you guys to separate again. Swing over, grab onto that. You can also swing from another character while they are climbing. So we need to switch back over to Yarny. Whoop, yeah, okay. And let's climb up like that. Okay, so this is very interesting for sure. I really like it. I don't know how long the episodes will be. Like I said, we'll try to tackle one chapter an episode. Uh, climb up down the, climb up and down the yarn to adjust the length of your swing. Yeah, that's what I tried to do before. So I want to fall off and then, yeah, do a little bit of that so we can ever so specifically get up like that. No boy, that didn't work. Just need to let go sooner. Oh, I need to wall jump, okay. Oh boy, come on, come on, swing, swing, yep, got it. <laughs> okay, so we made it, we just gotta climb up like this. Come on, good job, high five. Well, I don't, they don't have any fingers, so I guess I'll just be, I don't know what it would be at that point. Oh, oh, we can push away into here, what is this, a little well? I was right, caught it. Uh, you can swim through the, the water using L. Could we swim in the first game? I mean, it makes a lot of sense we can swim in this one, because we had that in the opening cutscene. Oh, this game is so pretty, I love it. The first one was too, so I'm just glad to see it's continuing in that idea. Uh, what what can I do here? Oh, oh, I almost got it, almost got it. Let's try that again. There, no, no, okay. Am I pressing the wrong button? Yeah, I was pressing the wrong button, I think. Uh. Ah, okay. Can you, okay, that was really weird, hold on. I sort of want you guys to combine again, if you can manage. Oh, no, you're drowning, you're drowning, you're drowning, you're drowning. No, 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 I don't like this, I don't like this. Get up there, get up there. Ah, no, don't, don't drown, don't drown, don't drown. Oh gosh, I was weird. There we go, yeah, I was just pressing the wrong button before. Okay, hop up like this as fast as you can. I mean, I like the idea that we can do little emotes with the D-pad, but I also sort of wish that we could just Use the D-pad as well for platforming. I wonder if there's any way I can change it. Oh, we're going up! Ooh, look at that, there's a little cottage in the background. Maybe that's our home. Our new home, whoa! Okay, oh boy, I thought we were gonna just have like a little running section inside the barrel with a bucket. I guess not. This is really nice. Definitely another like in the country kind of thing like we had in the first game. Be interesting to see Yarny and Yarno explore the big city, but maybe in Unravel three. So what have we got going on now? I guess this is our little makeshift home for the time being. Loading hub, the lighthouse in which we choose our path. See, this is probably, like it says, the hub where we can choose different levels. So we might have like a short first episode. I don't really know. We'll have to see, unless there's like still more in chapter one. Uh, start a new trophy earned, cool. Hello, anybody home? I guess not. I mean, the light was leading us here for a reason. Unless it's a total prankster. I don't know what's with the little light over Yarny. Is that just a character I'm playing? I suppose so. Hello? Oh, 
Now he has it in his hand. Oh. Okay. Birds. Lots of photos of birds that are sort of scary. Hmm. Oh. What is that? Is it like a portal? I'm a little confused. So we can swing on this. Oh. That's weird. I don't know what that does. It feels like it's an elevator of some sort I can maybe activate sooner or later. Well, let me first go here. Chapter two, hideaway. Oh no, I didn't actually want to go in then. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. Chapter two, hideaway in which we search for safety and companionship. Very cool then. Chapter two, we'll worry about in the next episode then and we'll try to do a chapter and episode. I feel like that would be pretty good, right? So yeah, even though we might be entering this, I'll worry about it in the next episode. I don't know how long it takes to load the level. We'll have a little sneak peek of it. Oh, we're definitely not on location I was expecting we'd be in. It looks like a hospital. Okay. Hello? Did we bring our friend? Come on. Come on, make your way through. Follow the yarn. Wow. Oh, okay, he's just walking off. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, who's that? The door's locked. Oh my. Is this a memory or is she like a spirit? Oh, oh no. I think she's like a spirit because things are getting knocked over even though she's all cloudy. Oh, That's sad. Maybe we can help in some way. Oh, well, who's that? There was another one. Oh no, it's chasing her. This is awful. Help, help Yarny and Yarno. With your combined strength, you might be able to close the door. Okay, you know what? Maybe we'll do chapter two as well in today's episode. We'll make it like a double whammy because I'm really compelled now. <laughs> uh, what do I gotta do? First off, let's get up like this. That did something. We're glowing, we're glowing. Okay but how do I get our friend over to this next one? Uh, there's nothing to really get onto, is there? Uh, I don't know. It'd be cool if we could climb on top of each other. Can we do that? He's like pointing over to this one. It's clear that we gotta do something. Oh, I pushed this. Okay, so yeah, that's a little weird because how do I get over to the other one then? Um, I'm not sure. Cause like I can get to, oh, you know what? No, it makes a ton of sense. Just push this one over like that. Hold on tight, lady. I'm almost here to help. There we go. Whoa, what's happening? Push that door closed. Right? No? Oh, you did it. Good job. I don't know if she can see us. I don't think she can. Oh, she's going out the window. I swear, maybe they looked like there was somebody maybe calling over to her from the window. This definitely seems to be some kind of maybe a, a, like an institution, a hospital, maybe a school. Maybe just apartment buildings, but that looks a little weird with how she was just knocking on different doors. Okay, so we need to make a bridge here. Tie that up. Tie this up. Come on, come on. Got it. And then let us combine, right? Oh, 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 oh. We can't combine right now because we had the bridge. That's right, okay. Always forget that part, that little detail. Now we can combine. Yeah, okay. So yeah, this is a little bit different. Maybe we are sort of kind of in the city. <laughs> oh, we gotta get up like this. Got it. Okay. Oh geez, we're falling. So we just gotta keep following the light. Oh gosh. <laughs> Was not ready for that. Oh, this will blow us upwards. Oh, I like that. Oh, I see what we gotta do. We need to switch. No, that's not what we do. Okay. Well, I sort of, I had the right idea. I just sort of messed it up. We need to switch into two and then climb up, but then use that to get up there. Okay. Come on, come on, you can do it, Yarno. Got it. So switch over to Yarny, and climb up like this, and then we can combine again. Yeah, okay, so we're in this little attic. Hello? Oh boy. Swing. Got it. <laughs> but what else was over here? There has to be like a secret somewhere, right? Not around here, that's for sure. Maybe there's no secrets in this game. I honestly, you know, that wouldn't be too bad. If it, that way I could just focus on exploring. 
That might be cool, or just like enjoying the game without having to worry about every collectible. Did I do something wrong? Oh, I gotta go in here, okay. Oh my, get up. Whoa, whoa, -ho -ho, some big jumps. No, 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 don't slide, don't slide. Oh yeah, I gotta use the power of two there as well. Just gotta jump out, swing like that, switch into two, and then, okay, I gotta let that sort of separate a little bit more. Just like that, got it. And then, can you come on over? You should be able to. That's it. Oh, this is so cool. Now we can slide. I love just how these two get along so quickly, and it's, they're on the same page. Okay. Oh, I love how he did a little flip. Oh, he's adorable. They're adorable. Oh, what is that little glowy thing? Oh, oh no, we got electrocuted. Not good. That's not what we wanted. Oh, you know what we could do? I think we can separate into two and then hold on tight, lower ourselves gently. That's it. Okay, so we need to go ahead and make a tie there and then jump. Got it. And then you should be able to plop on down now. Just like that, ooh, ooh, ooh. We got a collectible of some sort there. They are not easy to notice though. That's sort of concerning. Okay, so let's go down this way. What do we got? We're going down a big old pipe on the side of a wall. Yeah, this really does feel a lot more like a city. I mean, I guess it's more of like a town. Oh, oh boy. See, yeah, there's two of them. I guess two kids and it's adults looking for them. Oh gosh, don't tell me there's more than one adult as well. This is, they got the evil essence flowing from them. What is going on with all of this? There was three of them, I think. Oh, are we in a box? We're on top of a box. Oh, 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 that hurts us. Oh, okay. Weird, hard to see. I mean, at first, at the least. Oh, I had to ride on top of it. Weird, so it's sort of similar like the first game where Yarny can see these experiences, these memories that other people had and they sort of help lead him. These things sort of crawl around. Where am I trying to get up to? Okay, like this, yep, got it. So I gotta be careful. This evil essence is just sort of everywhere. Where there's good, there's bad, I suppose. So I wonder if there's anything we can do to help or will this just help us learn the story of if we're gonna end up focusing on I am really bad at that. <laughs> but also, it's it's very interesting, right? Uh, the first game was just sort of the story of the old lady, I think, if I remember correctly, and, and just the people she knows, and how she's lost connection to her family over time. And in this game, I'm guessing it's about two people, the, the boy and the girl there, that's, that's what it looked like to me. Um, and that makes me think, maybe it's sort of, you know, the same thing that Yarny's in, in this situation, where it's the, it's the power of you know, two people combining their efforts, you know, for the sake of safety or for the sake of friendship or whatever. Okay, so we have to use wall jumping to get past this guy, I think. It's looking, oh no, 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 I see what I gotta do. I gotta wall jump off of that, do a little bit of that, very cool. Okay, I, oh gosh, I, I jumped there, it didn't really work. Tried to, I guess it, while you're sliding, you can't jump, I don't think. Oh boy. Oh no, I'm not gonna be able to make that. Wait, what did I do wrong? Oh, I was supposed to, I know. It's weird to get used to, because that was just not a thing that happened in the first game, is that I can go up to this, we can separate into two, and then I can switch to Yarny, and then I can just swing off, and then use that momentum, of course, to get up like this. And I keep forgetting that kind of stuff, because once again, it wasn't a part of the first game at all, it's just a totally new mechanic to get used to. Okay, where are we going now? Up this way, I gotta push this, Got it. Okay, so what do I do about this, though? Oh, I can push this one ever so slightly. I'd... Oh, you know what? Uh, I don't know, though. If I maybe push this one this way, would that be helpful at all? Because then I can push it, but no, that doesn't. Okay, maybe now I can just climb up and I can combine, push it like, because we can only push this when we're combined, for some reason. But that doesn't really do anything. I mean, I guess if maybe it was pushed the other way, sort of hard to say, but yeah, I guess that would make sense. 
Well then let's, no, 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 that's wrong. Ah, oh, that's so weird. Uh, I can ask for a hint if I need it, but I think, is that right? Yeah, that is right, because now I can push this one this way. See, I got it. Just took a little bit to piece together. Get up like that, turn over to Yarny, and climb on up to meet Yarno. Come on, what button am I pressing that's wrong here, this one? At least he moves pretty quickly. That's always nice. Okay. And there's like a lot of other obstacles we can just walk right under, so <laughs> that's pretty nice. Oh, look, there's a car in the background. This this whole game is really nice looking, I love it. It's how Yarny seems to be able to avoid the public eye. Oh, here we go, here we go, whoop. Whoop, whoa, some major momentum, but not quite enough, I didn't see that one up there. Okay, oh gosh, didn't quite get that. Didn't really use it as well as I should have. Whoop, oh, that's so tough to reach. I just gotta build up more momentum from all this. He's such a little gymnast. Swing, no, 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 what, what is going on with that? Come on, Yarny, you can do it. Got it? No, <laughs> come on. Again, oh, you know what, because I'm doing it wrong. I thought I was supposed to build up momentum, no, I'm just supposed to wall jump. I'm pretty sure wall jumping wasn't in the first game, or if so, it wasn't utilized the same way. Oh my, we got water sprinting out from this fountain. I don't know if that hurts or not, so I'm just gonna avoid it for now. Look at this, this is such a pretty area. So they hid under the bridge. Oh, there's a little kitty cat. Hey there, kitty cat. Guess the kitty cat sees the spirits as well. I hope the kitty cat's okay. Oh, so we gotta get up like that. For no particular reason. You'd think they'd just wanna walk around it, but not quite. Oh, I see exactly what we gotta do here then. I'd actually go back this way, hop up like this, and then I'm pretty sure we have to do this. That way, with this little sort of pinpoint, I can whoop. Just like that. It's such an interesting concept. I have not seen a platform where really utilize co-op play. That's a really cool thing to use the environment. Because that was sort of the fun thing about the first game, is that you really get to utilize the environment in such a fun way. Okay, just gotta slide up like that, I guess. Couldn't have climbed up the staircase. Oh, skate park! Let's have some fun! Do a kickflip, hiya! <laughs> uh, I don't know if we're gonna be able to do that, but that would be so cool. I mean, we can push it, I don't know if it'll actually be helpful for anything, but why the heck not? Okay, got it, got it, got it. Can we get it all the way up? Okay, ride it. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh no, oh, we definitely need it to sort of get ourselves up there. Where'd it go? Right here. So I need to push it up again. Come on, push, 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 push. Ooh, we got it all the way up there this time. Come on, come on, and then push back down, just like that. Momentum, momentum, uh, okay. You know what I gotta do? It's pretty obvious, but I, I didn't wanna have to do it. I thought it would be cool if we could just ride it. What we gotta do is push it all the way up there, and then switch, and you should be able to hold it like that, or not. No, just like that, there you go. Okay, so, now we, or maybe not. That's sort of weird, I'm sliding right off. Oh, that's really weird, I don't understand. Huh. Yeah, what am I doing wrong? I don't understand, that's weird. Maybe I could do the same thing, but back this way? Even though this ramp seems like it's slightly higher up. But maybe if I could just do that and then, okay, whoa, momentum didn't really work the way I thought it was going to. Okay, and then jump, no, that doesn't work. Okay, I'm looking up a hint for this one because I'm not getting it. What's the button for hint, that screenshot? Uh, what is the hint button? Okay, press right to turn on slow motion. You will not be able to set times, okay, I didn't want that. But why would I want slow motion? I don't understand. Like, okay, the slow motion I guess sort of kind of helps, but at the same time, I was sort of looking for fundamentally what to do. Okay, this time we actually got it stuck up there, for better or for worse. There we go. See, that didn't work last time and then jump. That just, like, okay, the slow motion was sort of helpful, but I that just didn't happen the last time. It wasn't getting stuck on the little part of the half pipe. I don't know, that was weird. Anyways, we're at the next part. They're still hang, hanging out in the park, having a good time. We need to hang along with them, and then use that momentum, oh, just to barely get up there. Okay, is there something with this bucket? Looks like it. 
Okay. Oh, you know what? We need this bucket. Let me go ahead and do this, and then move down this way, just like that, and then I gotta go down it, if I can, and push this up. Let the pro handle it, Yarno. You just hang out up there and look pretty. <laughs> just because Yarny has already done all this in the past, right? He's sort of an expert at making bridges. Hopefully he's not as good at burning them down. Okay, so how do I get up there? There's gonna have to be a way. I'm thinking we wanna, oh, is that what I wanted to do? I mean, now I can't get it back up. At the least, I could make a little bouncy bridge. I don't know if that's all that good of an idea, though. Oh, look at us do these little tricks, I love it. Okay, that's, yeah, I don't know how much that's actually helping. Like, can I push this back up now? Oh, I can. Okay, then, no problem. I thought that I wasn't gonna be able to recover from that. But I can just fine. <laughs> I like Yarno, just like, yeah, bring it over here. Okay, so now it's right, oh gosh, don't fall, don't fall, it falls the moment I retract the bridge, come on. That was weird. Okay, so I guess I have to have one person hold it. But we can at least make it the bridge again, push it this way. Okay, it's knocking itself over. Just like that, switch over to Yarno and hop on up. There we go, so now we can not have to worry about that. I can just climb up. Oh, oh, do I still have more to break? I just wanna get up there with our friend. Why is it not working? Okay, maybe the wrong button? Probably the wrong button. Oh, we got a slide, Wee! <laughs> I like that. So yeah, we'll, we'll get two chapters done in today's episode, just for fun. I mean, hopefully the chapters aren't as long as I'm thinking they will be. But I'm not sure, I don't know how long of a game this will be. It's like, what was it, $20? $20, I think? Okay, so what am I doing wrong here? Oh yeah, I know, I know, I know. I always forget this, but I can use one character, and then we can start swinging from him. That is just something you really gotta sort of do a lot to get it in your instincts, but once you do, I'm, I'm sure it's gonna be fun. Okay, got it. And then we can hang on to this one, no? Yeah, hard to tell. There we go. So I need to fall so that I can swing and get to this other part. I, oh, okay. Yeah, we can do things we were never able to do before because we have friends. Isn't that cool? Okay. And, got it. Guess I should've, could've just plopped down like that. Oh my, this looks a little confusing. Is this gonna start rotating? Indeed it is, ooh. Keep moving, keep moving. Where are these even supposed to be? Are they supposed to be some kind of like, thing in the playground? Never seen these before. And then can we get up there? I can. And then from here I can start swinging as well. Got it, okay, very cool. Oh gosh, wrong thing, wrong thing. Climb up, climb up, you got it. You got it, it's not working. Come on, come on, come on, there we go. So now what? Gotta get in this way. Oh, I know about these things, they're all rolly and stuff. <laughs> got it. Okay, a, a cool little playground. Looks like fun. I guess it's still going too, it's a big playground. I mean, I guess everything's big to Little old Yarny and Yarno right now. Oh, how do we get up there? I mean, maybe just with enough momentum? That's looking like the case, but maybe I'm wrong. Oh boy, almost got it just like that. Ooh, yeah, okay, so that's the second collectible in this level. I'm really hoping that the first one didn't have anything. Warning out of order. Oh, this one's a little busted. What's with that? What was it even supposed to be? I don't know. Huh. You know what, I think I know what I, I do here. I get you, and then I'm gonna pull you. No, 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 okay, that's gonna work. That sorta kind of worked. I thought that I just had to have you hold on. But I suppose not. <laughs> He's just like, oh, I'm getting stuck. And then I get Yarny to hold on to this. Yep, that's it. And then switch over to you and have you let go. Yep, just keep moving it this way. Ah, that makes sense. Back to Yarny, no, I wasn't pressing the button. Yeah, that part's still really weird for me. Uh, but now that you're holding on to that, I should still be able to pull you and do the same thing twice, essentially. It's so weird, though. Hard to get used to. Because I need you to pull this all the way up, and then I will hop on like that, and it, sh it should fall, I guess not all by itself. And then I can have you jump if you just, there you go. 
Yeah, that is really tough to do, because you gotta remember to hold the button that you were holding to make him hold, you know? <laughs> or he'll just let go at the moment you switch over to him. It's definitely a lot to get used to. Okay, so what do we got going on with this? Something very similar. We gotta pull this somewhere, so that, yeah, I guess over this way, so that Yarno can hold on, and then we can just have you drag this along this way if we can, just like this, come on, drag it, drag it, drag it, and then do the same thing again, like we did before. That makes sense. Okay, so now we're doing this, and we're swinging, and okay, I just barely made it. That was scary. <laughs> And then pull on up. I wonder if we're getting to the end soon or not. I guess we're gonna find out as we go along. I don't know what the little sparklies above our head really mean though. That's something that's a bit confusing to me. Maybe it's how many things we found or that we can find. I just, maybe it's our lives. I don't think this game's gonna have lives. I feel like that'd be a total baloney. But I don't know. Okay, so we got flowers. Oh, this is a nice little walking path. I wonder what, I wonder what country this is inspired by, because I want to I want to hang out there. Seems like a nice place. Ah, we're swimming with the fishes. Okay, I gotta go back this way. I did that wrong. Okay, we can go over here before some kind of mean fish eats us. Come on, come on. Got it. So yeah, I gotta switch like that, go under. Okay, so I almost did that correctly. I just need a little bit more momentum. So. Lower ourselves a little bit if we can. That's it, that's it, okay. Now we can really, no, come on, dude. What was with that? Okay, no, oh, come on. That is so weird. Whoop, there we go. Oh, we're holding on to it, it's wibbling and wobbling. But from this spot, I might even be able to just slide or swing and get over like that. Okay, we got it. Hold on tight. <laughs> you just splash into the water. Okay, there we go. Oh gosh, be careful for the car. Gotta look both ways, you don't wanna be in danger. Whoa, okay, I didn't look both ways. The camera won't let me. That was scary, I don't like it. But I'd be careful. That's why I always gotta cross the crosswalk. Oh, there's a ladder, okay. Well, thank you, ghost people. Oh, maybe it's just two boys. It was hard to tell before. Maybe it is just a boy. I thought it was a boy and a girl. Or maybe these are different children. I'm very confused. Maybe there's just a bunch of angry guys running around yelling at kids and they're all hiding and I don't like that. It doesn't sound very nice. So what do we gotta do? Oh, this just launches us. Oh, I like that. Oh, you see that? There's definitely something glowy in that med kit to the left. I think, I'm almost positive. So what do we gotta do with that? I think that we have to do that and then with that, Yarny could just climb up like this. Is there any way to, you see how it's glowing in that med kit? There's definitely something in there. Maybe I could just use it like that, and then, yeah, you could do this. Like that might work, it might not. Oh, no, that didn't really look like it made any sense. I mean, that's clearly something, it's, it's just weird. I don't know, once again, I don't wanna spend all this time worrying about secrets when I could just be playing the game. I need to pull this down, if I can manage. There we go, and then switch over to you, and, okay, that's not really what I wanted. <laughs> We're gonna climb up this thing, and then jump on in, and come on, climb up, climb up, you got it, you got it. There we go. This is a creepy little factory building. Say that much. I need to make a bridge, and then I guess we could jump up it. Yeah, and climb up like that. Uh. Okay. There we go. Oh, I almost made a full loop, which is what I was trying to do. There we go. Okay, so I can break all those connections, climb on up, and Connect together, there we go, ooh, is that it? Or there's probably gonna be more, yeah, that would be like a weird way to end the level, like, oh, you went into the vent, you win. See, we might have a lot more to go. I guess these episodes might be very long to compensate for the fact that I don't have much room on my schedule to upload many episodes, so I hope you guys appreciate that, but man, is this pretty. I just really appreciate the fact that they're tackling new landscapes. 
because the first game had a lot of like countryside, big open fields and mountains and stuff. I'm trying not to hiccup, I'm sorry. Uh, but this one, so far is very uh, rural? Is that the proper word? Occupied, populated, that kind of stuff. No, no, no. Okay, so you're supposed to hold on tight to that. I see. So let's go ahead and boing, hold on to it, and then yeah, just lock on the place there. Now that we're up here, we should be able to break that bridge and have you just climb up. We might all fall in this process. I don't know. Oh, oh, you almost got it. There we go. Good job, good job. Combine, and we're good. Okay, whoa. Oh, hold on, hold on, I didn't quite make that. I think I'm doing things correctly, I just gotta get a little bit more momentum. Yep, flip right into the window. Okay, so more of this. I think that we want to do that, and then switch over, and then go like this, and then hop in, and then make this a bridge. That way we can hop up there a little bit. I think that's right. And then if it launches us up again, Okay, it won't quite work the way I was thinking, but we could just wall jump up it. Yeah, okay. We got it. And then do that, and then have you climb up. Oh boy, don't launch yourself right back in that thing. So all I need you to do, yep, 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 is do that. Okay. Oh, we got more of these things. So those guys must be close. Last time we saw this, those mean adults were walking around. So let's, let's see what's gonna happen now. Guess we gotta go up like this. Sometimes it can be a little bit difficult to tell what's going on, like visually, like where my character is and what the things are around it, and like what I can walk on and what parts are the background. So jump, no, I didn't swing. I guess I pressed the wrong button. That was just me being silly then. Get back up there, go, 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 got it, got it, got it. Okay, I just gotta wait for this sparkly little demon. Okay, start sliding, start sliding, jump, swing, got it, awesome. Hello. Oh, we got more of it. We gotta dodge it while we're climbing. That's not good. Dodge, dodge, I walked right into it again. It's, it's surprising how quickly they move sometimes. They sort of have like this creeping motion to them, you know? So, it gets a bit surprising. We definitely need to just go this way for now. Hmm. Oh, you know what? We'll probably have to separate, and then I need you to swing up there. Just like that was actually really easy. Okay. Hmm. Come on, there you go. Got it. Keep going, keep going. And into this little turbine area. I don't know if I, that's a good idea. Don't get chopped up. Okay, we're fine. No problem. Oh, this again. So we gotta be careful, just like last time. But if I were to do that, I can make a little bridge part there. That's not what I wanted to do. That's weird. Oh, I gotta go to the one on the right, land into the little blaster, the thing that has the A14 on it. Don't know what that's supposed to mean. Uh, and that'll launch me to the other side, right? It can only help, we. <laughs> oh, oh, are you okay, buddy? You got hurt a little bit, I think. Anyways, plop down like that, combine up. Oh, we can't combine, not until we get to the other side of the bridge. Okay, so can you get up on there? You can get up there. Okay, now that everything is safe, we can combine. Okay. This is such a cool game. I'm having so much fun exploring all this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I see, I see. We can't quite do this yet. It's not quite right, because we actually need to push this one to the left, go up like that, and then, ah, oh yeah, there's a couple things we can do here. I think we need to do this. We need to separate so the one of them stays there, and then, yeah, now that it's like that, we can make it so, I mean, we might just be able just to climb up it now, just like this. Climb up, climb up, don't do too much swinging. That's why it's weird with the joystick, instead of the analog sticks and stuff, instead of the, uh, the D-pad. I feel like it makes it harder to work with at times. Okay, now we can get up there. We did it, we figured it out, no problems. <laughs> just being bounced around. I mean, I don't know if it's a very good idea to have all these pipes that are just leaking, whatever fumes those might be. That might be a public safety hazard, but at the same time, Yanni doesn't breathe. 
Okay, so these kids made their way all the way up onto this roof. This seems dangerous. Do they not have a home? Maybe that's what they're running from. Aw, there's like a little play area. I think he's looking at a phone. I don't know if they're playing a game or watching a video. Maybe they're watching me. <laughs> that is a really self-centered thing to say. I'm sorry, I take it back. But they, they played here, that's sort of really cute. They got crayons and I think I saw like a Rubik's Cube. And is that it? I think that's the chapter over. Weird, I didn't really glean too much information from that, like what's going on with them in the story, but I guess it's what the other levels are for, right? Uh, in which we choose our path, the lighthouse. Okay, so very, very cool. So we did the first and second chapter, almost an hour worth of platforming fun there. Trophy earned, be safe. That's what I was saying, be safe, climbing up on the rooftops of places that you don't know, you know, where, who could live there. And we unlocked a couple more photos, not a complete one over there. One of them's like only halfway done. But I guess that unlocks another level down that way? And what, oh. Oh, I guess that's the elevator activated, huh? Looks like it. But what was that little, that little uh, thing that we had on the bottom, the little basket? Chapter two, hideaway, so we completed it. We got four out of six secrets, I think that's trying to say. And then there's a little star, and then there's a little uh, timer. I'm guessing the star means we would make our way through without dying, like acing it. And then the timer is, of course, to do it in a certain amount of time. Oh, here we go. Level completed, four out of, or six out of six. Okay, that's our collectibles found. Uninterrupt, uninterrupted playthrough without dying, and then we get our timer. So I was totally right on all of that. Very, very cool. So we completed the first chapter and the second chapter in today's episode, the first episode of Unravel 2. And like I said, I will try to get out as many episodes as I possibly can of this game, but there's a lot of action happening right now. We've been very busy with all of the current affairs with Pokemon Quest, some of the upcoming games like Balloons TD6, and of course, uh, Lego Incredibles. Lots of awesome games coming soon, including more of this, but they might be a little bit farther between. I'll try to do like a chapter and episode and see how everything goes. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Unravel 2. If you watched to this point in the video, make sure you comment Yarny Zebra so now you've watched to the end of the you are a zebra tasty viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen or right now or by subscribing and join the zebra herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.